so this is the data now if we want to insert one column then what we have to do right click after that insert and to our table has been inserted giving the name to serial so I have uh, typed something wrong and it's still automatically corrected it now giving serial one two three and how does it fail to fill the series like one two three four five six seven eight and up to hundred here it's eight so I can easily uh, type up to eight but uh, I think it's not easy to type up to hundred so Microsoft Excel has one great uh, get a solution for this that is called autofill option so here after pressing one two three yeah, after uh, pressing one two three at the place in the corner at the right side then after pressing down it goes down and similarly I am showing another examples okay I'm pressing one three five the three odd numbers and if we want to fill the series with the total odd number then the same way with the autofill option we can do that so after selecting this put the cursor on the right side right bottom corner and you can see at the right corner there's already filled up 13, 11, 15, 17. All the odd numbers are here. So here, this is called the autofill option. Yes, here you can do copy cell, fill this, and fill the formation all day, and these are the things. <coughs> so here I have done all the same thing. This is the putting on the serial in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then it is very easy options and you can do that with the autofill options. You can change it also with the by putting the cursor on the right side that small boxes. So placing it in the middle corner at uh, the middle and deleting this uh, column hotel is not that much required. Now making another score that is with the uh, let's say there's another number and I'm showing you another thing. This auto fill is not only the fill series only. Here, this fill will be only the 25 number and the whole through the seven uh, students, like 25. It's not that much easier to put on this same digit in every cell up to from uh, 25. Uh, this all are the 25 characters. Now we'll practice some functions and formulas. We can uh, fill the formulas in two ways. That is. Yeah, placing here and doing the equal sign putting on equal sign here we can also add formula and we can also putting the equal sign on the other side so typing equal after sum automatically you can see the sum option has come then now if we select one cell there's cell ranges the cell range is from c2 up to c8 equal sign then we will get the summation <coughs> excuse me now one cell is missing we what we can do that is if we place the number here and it give the equal sign and automatically the cell is added the number is changed and the total value is also changed we can copy the formula from uh, this cell to this cell that is selecting control c and control B and automatically in the same way the select in the range is just parallel to the left side and we can also put on the formulas in the right side by placing plus sign that means it's uh, generally for two cell is very much easier like selecting the cell C2 plus uh, D2 giving equal sign the cell has been added and the equally again we are taking the help from the autofill option the every cell from the left two cells are added and the values are getting we can also the changing the formulas from plus to minus we can subtract the value from C1 to C2 changing it to minus and it comes 12 or if we add another formula here that is from c12 if we multiply it then pressing shift enter it comes the total number numbers 
so uh, returning back control J control J now we'll give the give shape to this table for this this is called the control all and if we press this button here and this button here now almost the total uh, table has been in one shape now selecting this shape here if we want to give some border here is the border options a thick border the outside and if we give the border inside and here is another option that is the all borders we got if we want to copy the cells from here right click cut pressing it here paste paste done so this is the formula and to make the total background white pressing here this is the coloring to white so this is the shape now if we want to give one heading that is march at the center this is the one cell if we can increase the size and the height by this way you can write it at the center in the center now right mark sheet 2016 control by pressing all it's a bold or increase a little bit or uh, changing this like this one.